Vapertini is a device that lets people inhale alcohol. And this parasite eats the tongue of a fish, hooks itself into the muscles of the tongue stub, and becomes its new tongue. Vsauce, Kevin here. This is mind blow. This DNA gun invisibly tracks criminals for weeks. Developed by UK-based company Selectamart, the high-velocity DNA tagging system fires small, soft green pellets, kind of like a paintball, filled with a unique DNA code that can penetrate clothing and mark a suspect's skin. The idea is to mark criminals during a riot so they can be arrested later when the DNA tag is revealed using a UV light. The Hasso Plotner Institute in Potsdam, Germany has an interactive floor that creates a computer-generated reflection of you. The video screen floor is touch sensitive and the system uses infrared camera and high resolution projector. It tracks footsteps and beams video up to the glass. The hope is that this technology eventually leads to new ways of playing games, controlling objects in the home, or assisting disabled people. The Chemical and Biomolecular Engineering Department at NC State University has developed self-healing stretchable wires. The wire is made of a gallium liquid metal alloy and a self-healing polymer that heals it both mechanically and electrically after being severed with scissors. Dear Diary, today's I made a desk with a pillow on it so as I can sleep on my desk. Yeah! Engineers in Taiwan are developing displays for fingertips. The point is to still be able to see the display on your smartphone or tablet while your thumb is obscuring it. It even enlarges the view so it's easier to tap small buttons on a 2.5 centimeter diagonal OLED screen. And you can also see and answer incoming calls with it. The artificial photosynthesis system is being developed by Panasonic and is producing organic materials with the efficiency of real plants used in biomass energy. It uses sunlight to produce oxygen from water and carbon dioxide and they hope to use this to solve global warming and energy problems. Find the link below for more. Kilobots are tiny, cheap robots that are being used to research swarm algorithms. Designed by a research group at Harvard, they cost about $14 each, are 33 millimeters in diameter, and can communicate with neighbors up to 7 centimeters. Now let's just watch them swarm for a second. All I want to do is meet some men at party. All I want to do is meet some men at party. All I want to do is meet some men at party. The University of Southern California did a real-time MRI study of human beatboxing. This allows researchers to visualize the movement of the vocal tract from the upper trachea to the lips and the opening and closing of the vocal folds to help study the mechanisms that produce various sounds. Finally, the Monterey Bay Aquarium has a great video of the lobed comb jelly, which has comb rows that diffract light as they swim. I'm gonna leave you with sperm from two males competing within the reproductive tract of a female fruit fly. Seriously. And as always, thanks for watching. such a large selection of crackers in my grocery store. It's a mind blow. Wait, what's a mind blow? Ah, I've been waiting for you, Vsauce. Darth Vader? Why are you working in a grocery store? I'm Chad Vader, and I don't work here. I rule here as day shift manager. Click here to check out the latest season of Chad Vader. Ah, uh, and as always? And as always, thanks for choosing. The Dark Soul Half. Eh, close enough.